like once. We are then gonna send that video around so everyone else can see how to do it, okay? I'm gonna tell you once, okay? I'm gonna show you two ways of doing it. So by 11.59 and 59 seconds tonight, I need you to have handed in what you have done on your cyber safety ebook. okay? Happy? Mm -hmm. Good. Right, before we do anything, before you hand it in, at the moment, mine says a new book by a n author. You just need to make sure you put whatever the title of your book is and your name. Okay. Cool. So you should all have the um, Firefly Student Planner on your device. If you haven't, we'll sort that out. So this is how you're going to hand it in. This button there is the share button. You're going to export that as an EPUB file. Okay, and then you're going to literally scroll along until you get to your Firefly Student Planner, which is this one. I'm going to choose that. It'll then open up Firefly, and then you just need to choose the correct task that I have sent you, which is something like Cyber Safety ebook. If you have set, you know you can set your own personal tasks. Yeah, please don't hand it in to your own personal task. Please hand it in to the task that I have sent you. Okay, so I'm going to choose Cyber Safety ebook. Choose that. Can you now see it's uploaded that book? <coughs> yeah. I also asked you to do a secondary document that um, lists the, the sources that you use, like the, the web URLs and stuff like that. Can you also hand that into? If it's on your user area, you can hand it in via folder by going to send the file. Or if it's on Word, you know you can share files in Word when you've got the file open, just open it in Firefly and choose a task, do what we did last time. When you've handed in both of those documents, click mark as well. Okay? And that tells me that you are finished. So that's one way of doing it. The other way of doing it is by opening up your ebook and instead of opening it instead of saving it directly to Firefly, I'm going to export as an EPUB and then actually save it to folder. If I save it to folder, it means I've always got a copy of this document on my user area. So I'm just going to go to home folder, I'm going to go to this particular folder here, which I've done as a test, um, attachments, and then I'm just going to save it. Save here, and that will upload it to my user area. I'm just going to overwrite what I've already done. Okay, and then back in Firefly, I can go send a response to teacher, send the file, it'll come up with browse, if I click on that, it should then open up my files, I can choose folder, and then I can go through and find that document and hand it in that way, okay? I don't mind which way you do it, however, it might be a good idea, no matter which way you do it, to just end up saving a copy of your ebook on through folder onto your user area. Everybody happy girls? Yeah. When you're done, do you reckon you'll be able to do that quite easily? Yeah. Okay? If you can't, watch the video we're about to send around, okay? Or just ask someone. Ask one of you guys. You, one of you out of all of this whole class will know how to do it. Okay? Girls, awesome. Thank you very much. Thank you for filming.